Hey there, everyone. Welcome to part one of the inactives report for the AFC, the AFC South. We'll be doing Tennessee Titans and Jacksonville Jaguars now. Indianapolis Colts versus Las Vegas Raiders will come later on. That's right, because Colts and Raiders, they'll be on at 4.05. Let's start off with the away team, the Tennessee Titans. Here are the main inactives, besides Adoree Jackson and Kenny Vaccaro. I already mentioned Kenny Vaccaro in my last video. The other three are as follows. Darrington Evans not playing. Deonta Foreman not playing. And finally, Wyatt Ray. We're going to be down two running backs this game. So, King Henry's going to rock, going to be running, or, or Jeremy McNichols is going to be stepping up to the plate. I just hope that means King Henry's ready to rock and roll, because we're going to be in this without two running backs. So yeah, it's fall. So the final injury report for Tennessee is as follows: Adoree Jackson, Kenny Vaccaro, Darrington Evans, Deonta Foreman, and Wayat Ray. If you think I'm missing anyone else, no, I'm not. I already aware of it. They just they just don't get mentioned, okay? Because they because they already know they're out. Because they already know they're out. Now on to the Jacksonville Jaguars injury report. The following people that are out as follows. Rookie quarterback Jake Lunnan. Cornerback Greg Mabin. Linebacker Kamali Correa. Which means he won't get payback against the Tennessee Titans. <laughs> Sorry, Korea. Next up, linebacker Quincy Williams, and then tight end Tyler Davis, and defensive end Reggie Gilbert. The two that survived are Sidney Jones and cornerback Sidney Jones and tight end Tyler Eifert. Those two are the only ones that survived. Anyway, see you later when I bring you the Indianapolis Colts and Las Vegas Raiders injury report.